Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. It's Topher. Appreciate you being here as always. Today we're going to go into Torgas and we're going to go and check out the new Beast of Pro Prodigum? Prodigum? I'm not sure how to say it still. Uh, we're going to go check out those abilities and see what it's going like. Uh, we'll probably walk through it pretty damn easy because our eye level's 209 now and we're a hunter so life's just easy as a hunter as always um but uh if you're enjoying the content go ahead and leave a like hit that sub button and uh we'll keep publishing this content as much as we can all right let's do this thing all right soul forge is eight shouldn't be too bad this morning it was actually bugged in my previous video i talked about the bug a little bit and uh talked about the powers a little bit more in depth than i will now um i'm gonna get my pet out here switch over to these two talents and let's get it going all right so we got valiok and now tari all right we're gonna take the The increase allies uh, damage. Look at that guy. It's pretty sick looking. He looks like the mount from Antorus, which is pretty dope. All right, let's do it. Left should just be some anima power or something like that. Shouldn't be anything too crazy. So, doesn't look like I've gotten. It doesn't look like it shows me what the buff is. I guess we'll see. Take that 100% increased kill shot damage. And then I'm going to actually have to end up buying some food on this run because we take ticking damage here, which absolutely sucks as a hunter because I have two spells and some pots. All right, let's 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 shoot something. Let's see what uh, see what we got going on here. Nah, I mean, it's not, like, overly impressive. Like, there's nothing really that it is that he's giving me right now that's making me hit crazy. But I'm hoping as it goes on, it'll be a little bit easier. Or a little bit more OP, I should say. I guess, I guess the Soul Beast is hitting, he's hitting really fucking hard. He's hitting really hard. Um, okay. Yeah, I mean, I don't know. Doing about average damage right now. I honestly expected, since it's like an event sort of thing, you know, I, I, I halfway expected it to be just ridiculously overpowered. Um, I mean, Torghast itself is just all around pretty overpowered in general. So, for it to not be overpowered, i quite surprised. to get in for this. Wow, I wish I could heal. That would be so freaking nice right about now. Come on, animal power. Give me some heals. I'm gonna run out of food here. Oh, yeah. And 35% mastery, which isn't terrible. That's, that's decent, but I want to see those uh, powers for the uh, the mall beast. Is that what thirty five percent anima just did to me? Jeez, where that came from? Yes, nice little rare. I'm wondering if this is because it's kind of like a mall beast or. You know, whatever. Wondering if it will um, give us something pretty crazy. Just a 
stop standing right in front of him where he's thrashing. Yeah, this just feels like any other run to me. The maximum health of your mall base is increased by 100%. That's... I need the health regen literally way more than that. Like, my mob beast is doing nothing for me right now. It genuinely feels like a good old Torgas run. So, like, I, I assume if it dies, you just don't get it back, right? Like, it's kind of weird to me. Yeah, at least my kill shot's dope. I think it's at 200%. Yeah, I mean, that's pretty decent. I'll take that. What's up, dude? You're kind of useless. Now, Tari. Doesn't regen health, it doesn't look like either, which is, I guess, understandable? Question mark? No. Alright, let's see here. Hmm, okay. Come on, pet. Dude, that thing just gets wrecked by that whirlwind, and there's nothing I can do about that. Like, what? Oh my god. Oh jeez, I just blinked right into that. And, okay. So, our pet, okay, he's not dead, and he is actually healing. I'm not sure where he got heals from, but my pet apparently isn't done fighting, so I guess we're going into the next battle. That's just like, fuck it, dude, let's go. Okay. Just tab targeted. Something I didn't want to shoot my rapid fire at. It's pretty cool. That uh, kind of came in handy. Sorry, pet. Had to let you die. Let's see what we get here. Healing of your mob beast is increased by 50% and also heals you as well. That is symbiotic essence. And then erratic howler while in combat release an uncontrolled howl at random. Oh, that's just the rare. I'm going to take the increased damage and increased healing. Um, let's see. Let's see what that's like. I'm willing to bet that it does pretty much nothing, but I guess we're about to find out. It's like it's ticking on me, like, just barely. I mean, it's not bad, I guess. It's better than nothing. Yeah. Oh, I guess I just healed myself, too, so... Yeah, the, he the healing isn't, like, overly impressive or anything like that. Alright. Uh, got a couple of these. Yeah, 
I mean, the healing done is subpar, to say the least, about these dogs. I, I would almost say if there is, like, abyss, um, you know, animal power for you at the start, it's, it's worth to take it, at least over now Tari. Okay, it's just not worth it to me. I think they dropped the ball on this one. Pretty hardcore. Alright, let's see what this thing's got. Let's see what damage he did there. Yeah, I mean, that that is a little bit more worth it, but all right. So we can have him reduce his special ability by fifty percent when your mob beast reaches critical health. It, it detonates and inflicts fifty percent of its maximum health. Is sent. I don't want that, so cool down on the special ability, I suppose. Um, let's actually just go this way. Mastery is good, but I'd rather increase all stats versus just a couple of them. Um, okay. not expect that. That was not enjoyable. Alright, well, I mean, I'm going to wait for cooldowns for this boss, so I'm going to go down here real quick and fight these dudes, see if I missed anything. I didn't. You know what? I'm just going to go. Yeah, I need to interrupt that firebolt. So I'm going to die here. All right, I'll just eat real quick, and then we'll go kill the boss. Just fucking kidding. Heal my fucking donkey up. See what damage he's doing there. Yeah, my my pet actually ended up doing more damage than than him there. Oh, we did get two anima from that. That's kind of nice. Uh, useless and pretty much useless. I mean, kind of. I guess that one, that second one's not terribly useless here, but. Now we'll fight this last boss. Get rid of him. I guess it's not last boss, we got two more floors, but last boss of this floor. special for the mall beast and really nothing special for me so there's the boss Give me my damn anima. Don't you come sneaking up on me like that. Thinking I'm gonna fucking die. Not today, Jeeves. Not today. Oh, 
Oh, no, you don't, bitch. You're hurting rough, dude. Don't you dare kill my pet. Don't do it. That's what I thought. Alright, your mastery, I guess, yeah, I mean, I'll take the reduction of arcane, I only got, like, one arcane spell, it's not the end of the world for me to take that, TBH, I'm gonna edit that out. Alrighty, we're on floor six now, so last boss... Caster boss too. Shouldn't have any issues because we were able to pick up smokes earlier on. Um, we'll get an aim shot here, which is nice to have that. Pick up our anima. Use this. We got plenty, so we might as well buy this extra life just in case for some reason I die six times on this boss. I can't imagine that would happen, but hey, crazier things have happened. Hopefully we got something good from that. Agility increased by 150%. I will take that all day. Increased our verse and haste there as well. So this boss is pretty much dead before we even get there. No thanks to the new beast that we picked up. But hey, you know what? Beggars can't be choosers. And we got a 40 second cooldown on this. So I mean, I guess we can get a pool in real quick and see what it's like without it. Yeah, we should be fine without it. We'll go ahead and just heal my pet up to full here. Yeah, we're, we're fine. We'll one-shot it easily. Alright, and that's it. We'll get our Soul Lash and we'll call it a day. But uh, as far as the Guardians go, I'm not impressed at all. I think they're kind of weak. If we're being honest, take a screen cap there. But yeah, anyways, if you enjoyed the video, go ahead and hit that like button. If you're not subscribed, consider subscribing. It would really help me out. I have a goal of 1,000 subscribers by the end of 2021, and I hope you can help me achieve that goal. Also, go subscribe to Asmongold. Let's get him to a million freaking subs. Thanks, guys. Peace.